going to do a string test on my baby horse and God willing we have time to grow together. We'll see if it works. He's supposed to be 10 months old. He was a thoroughbred, bred for the track, out of proud English and uh, street boss. Yeah. Anyway, he got injured uh, at weaning and ended up crushed under a fence or something. I don't know. They were going to put him down. So two gales got involved. I didn't ask him if I could talk about him and I'll put their picture here. I didn't ask if I could talk about him, so we'll call one of the gales Periwinkle, and we'll call the other one White. So White's son worked at this farm down in Kentucky, and he burned this baby, he watched it grow, he weaned it, he helped it wean, and then he saw it get hurt, he took it to Root and Riddle, and they said, put it down, he's never gonna run. White's son said, no, no, let me call my mom, she'll take it. So he called his mom, White called Periwinkle. Periwinkle uh, took it. She had it for a, a couple of weeks and said it was too much for her. She's got a lot going on anyway. So she called White and said, can I come to your farm for a minute? And White said, yes, we'll find it a home from here. And I had talked to these gales, uh, White and Periwinkle, for a couple of years, really. Uh, and um, we all used to really hang out a lot. And then for whatever reason, we all dissipated. And, uh, they rescued this horse, and now they're back. God bless it. They named him Periwinkle. They, Periwinkle named him Pride. White named him Big Buddy. And then, so when he came to my farm, I gave him the name Yashua's Pride and Big Buddy. So he's Yashua's Pride for G. So the string test, I keep saying people talk about it, but they don't say what it is. So I have a measuring tape out of my sewing kit. And they say if you measure from the knee to the coronary band, I guess, that is an indication of how tall they're going to get. You transfer inches into hands. We'll see. i got to get the little guy up here. So I'm going to go get him. I've never done this to him. He's just a baby. He's 10 months old now. Yashua's pride. Let me see if I can grab him up here. hands tall. <laughs> I'm kidding. I put it on the knee and like all I could find on the internet was that you, it's okay, that you go with the contour of the lake so a metal tape wouldn't work. So you, you can buy these for like a dollar for your sewing kit. Or if you don't sew, just, just for this. band 17 hands exactly so we'll have to see god willing hey 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 can i have <laughs> god willing we make it together that's going to be a big one my biggest yet except for the draft right over there he's about to eat my camera Let's see is it big enough to weigh with you oh it's scary <laughs> exactly this. 60 inches divided by four. So there you go. This is my new baby. We don't they don't know if it was a head injury or a spinal injury. He does drag his back feet when he walks. Walk a little bit quicker. There's none of that. There's no 
dragon at me. He runs all over the place. I get mad. I got this altar and four uh, young horse. It's not gonna work. It's only gonna fit into this for about another month. So it's going back and I'm getting, I guess, just horse. So 17 hands is what it says, 17 inches, it'd be 17 hands. That's a big, big boy. Now he was only gilded about a month ago. And way laid back, too laid back for a thoroughbred, really. He sleeps all day. But my goal with this horse, whether he's rideable or not, is to teach him to dance. He is way laid back. He's pretty smart. He already figured out today that if he doesn't want to have to go, he doesn't a long time to get into the camera. See, this is rain on falling out right there. So there's the string test, I think. If I'm wrong, somebody tell me in the comment section below if that's not what the string test is. I read it. Nobody actually says what it is. So I'm making it up. Maybe I'm sure that some genius would tell me. That's it, we did street